You know, now that your friends are here, this place is starting to feel like a real home. Matthew and Walter are amazing people. Honestly, it's dangerous to be this kind, but they can't help it. Wait until you meet Matthew. He's a real character. The first time he met me, he called me Rita. What does Matthew look like? Oh, he's a handsome man. A little shorter than Walter. He should be back soon. Clem, I wanted to ask you, does Kenny seem different to you? I didn't know him before, and, well, I'm curious. He has good days and bad days like everyone else. I haven't noticed. Oh, well, let me know if you do. Well, you three have been busy. Kenny, isn't it great? I got it, huh? I think I can manage, Ken. I said I got it. Always has to play the gentleman. But I'll tell you, when I met him, he couldn't lift a fly. That's not a gentleman. <laughs> That's a... Um... Why don't you go see if your friends are ready for dinner, Clementine? Chauvinist? I don't know. He, he, I, he seems edgy. He seems like he's on edge. Okay, that scared me. I thought everything was done. Nothing else in the box? Let's talk to you. Are you okay? Just got a little dizzy. I can't even take care of myself. How am I supposed to raise a child? Mm. I mean, how can anyone now? It's not gonna be easy. I know it's gonna be hard. But at the same time, I already feel a little less lonely. Because I know that no matter what happens, I'll get to meet someone new. Is that fair to the baby He's though? Kicking. You wanna listen? That food smells good. Gross. <laughs> Can I? She's gonna be a runner. Do you feel it or do you hear it? What's wrong? It's not his. His? Who? Whose is it then? Whose is it then? If Alvin finds out, he'll kill me. I don't know what to do. I can't believe I'm asking a little girl for advice. But I guess nothing's weird anymore. He won't kill you. There's my man. You all right, baby? I'm fine, you big dope. Just need to get some food in you. Thanks for staying with her, Clem. Well, everyone, dinner is served. Come on, let's eat. Oh, God, back. Who have you been... shacking up with? I have a feeling shit's really gonna hit the fan. I, I am not ready for the drama. You okay, man? Yeah, I'm just... I wish I hadn't pulled that trigger. Mm. Just try to forget about it. Right here, Clem. Oh, come on. Don't do this to me. Really? You're gonna you're gonna make me decide between Luke and Kenny? Okay, Luke, you have to understand. I knew Kenny from before. And it's been years, okay? I want to sit and talk to him. That doesn't mean that I don't like you, because you're great. You're like my big brother, okay? So, I would go to you, but... I'm sorry! <laughs> oh, God! Go, huh? <laughs> that doesn't mean anything! Oh, Luke, come on, don't do that! We were just talking. What's the deal with the kid? And what's his name? Luke? He in charge? You trust him? Luke is amazing. Kenny, please. Sarita, we don't know these folks. I like him. He's a good guy. Would you trust him with your life? Luke? Yeah. I think so. Nick, not so much. Luke, yes. That guy, Big Al, he said they were on the run. Some people are after them. Well, you don't have to worry good, about that good. no more. They'll go tomorrow and you can stay here. Uh, Absolutely. Mm. Honey, you stay with us as long as you want. She's staying for good. I, that's what uh, she wants. I can't leave my friends. What? Of course you can't. They can stay too, 
No, not that's no. not what I meant. <laughs> I'm referring to Krista. Krista. I'm looking for a Krista, damn it. Can we swap places? I mean, I could mix and mingle, you know? Hi. Hey there. Hey. Hope you like the food. Oh, it's it's great. Thank you. Peaches <laughs> and beans. Great for nutrition. Not too great on the way out, though, I tell you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so it's Luke and Nick. Luke and Nick. You guys sure do look like a match. What's that supposed to mean? I'm just saying you look like good friends, that's all. So, what was your plan here? Hold out for the winter? Actually, we were thinking of moving on. Somewhere up north. You ever heard of a place called Wellington? Wellington? Oh. The hell is that? A place. Yeah. Krista and I were going there. Why is everyone heading to, to Wellington? A camp up near Michigan. Michigan? You got a hearing problem, kid? Yeah, Michigan. Think about it. Fresh water, lots of land, and cold ass winters so the walkers get slow. Sounds like bullshit. Listen, Vanilla Ice. I don't know hmm. what your deal is, but you're more than welcome to take off in the morning. That'd be just fine by me. What's the deal with these guys, Clem? Hey, fuck you, buddy. It's fine, Nick. We're not staying. She's staying. Please, don't fight. What's wrong with you people? Gentlemen, Go please. On. There's no need for this. Now look, we've all had a long day. Please eat. So it's Princess Kenny versus Princess Nick. <laughs> Ask me that uh, can, duck. <gasps> I am not duck. Duck? Who's Kenny? Duck? Uh, leave, leave him, him alone, Luke. Leave it. Leave it. Don't go there. Hey, Clementine, would you uh, lend me a hand outside for a moment? Yes, thank you. I would love to go. Leave all this drama behind. <laughs> Again, like Lee said, I, I, I would just like to strike out on my own. Just strong, independent, Clementine woman. No, oh, that looks so good. Uh, I'm sorry about that. You know, I used to be a teacher, and I remember what it's like to be caught in the middle of two clicks. Hmm. I suspect they'll find common ground soon enough. It may take a little time, but that's just how these things work. Everything will be fine. <laughs> relationships are like any machine. You don't throw them out when they break down. You get your hands dirty and you grease the wheels. I'll I'll I'll, I'll let him talk. Will you help me work on them. The two of us must unify our factions for the common good. You know, like Churchill and Roosevelt. He seems to enjoy. They say the world is over. Speaking. But I'll tell you a secret. It's not. No, it's People not. People are more political now than they ever were before. That's true. In the end, we can't change the world. All we can do is continue to learn from each other, to empathize and use our heads. All war is a symptom of man's failure as a thinking animal. Steinbeck, have you read him? No, but I well, think Lee would have liked you. you on your reading. My partner Matthew is amassing quite the literature collection. Partner? I think like him. Hmm. In any case, the point is, as long as we have our wits about us, we can always make the right choice, right? I. Uh, it, it's not that black and white. It's never that easy. I know you're optimistic, but What's you have to be realistic as well. Is there something you want to tell me? You can talk to me, Clem. There's almost nothing you could tell me that would surprise me. I can promise you that. I'm just worried about the people chasing us. You're safe now. Don't worry. Matthew will be back soon. And. Everything will be fine. Hey, kids, what are you two talking about? I I want to bring up the guy at the bridge. Oh, I have to. The hell? Well, being from Florida, I would imagine you know all about politics, Kenny. Man, I know one advantage of living in the apocalypse is not dealing with that shit no more. I was just going to check the windows round back before this storm hits. Give us a hand? Sure. Sure. And then we can talk about Matthew. Hello? Miss? 
Who's that? Please, do you have any food? Are you okay? I saw the house and I have a family. We're starving. We live down there. Uh, uh, of course. Why don't you come in, Miss... Bonnie. Walt, I don't know. You just gonna let her in like that? It's fine, Kenny. We don't know this girl. Then we'll have to get to know her. Right, Clem? Walt, how much damage can this poor woman do? Check her for weapons. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Really, but that storm will be on us soon, and I gotta get back to my family. I'll bring something out to you, then. You don't have to do that. No, no, it's fine. What about your people? We've got plenty. You stay put. I'll be right back. Don't tell people that, dude. Walt is way too trusting. I have a little girl like you. Really? How old are you, sweetie? I... I'm 11. Ar aren't I? I'm 11. I would have thought older than that. Hmm. In my heart, I am. Much older. Ancient. That's a lot of stuff, dude. Here you are, miss. This is too much. Don't mention it. I don't know how to thank you. Just help someone else down the line. Thank you so much. I'll be going now. You stay safe. You too. I really hope it's genuine. <laughs> it seems coincidental. I'm going inside and get to bed. Walt and I gotta talk for a second. Oh, Kenny, stop your alpha bullshit. We really need to talk about Matthew. Come on. Clementine, don't freak out. Listen. I gotta tell you something. That guy on the bridge was Walter's friend. Oh no. We are so fucked. See, I knew something was off, so I asked Sarita about their friend. Now they're all worried he's not back yet. I know he was. For sure. Damn it. Damn it, Nick. Oh god. I don't think Walter knows yet. So we have to keep this quiet. I mean, who knows what the hell he'd do if he found out. No, we have to tell him. We have to tell him. We should tell him. He's going to ask who did it. And you're going to tell him. Yes, of it's course. It's the right thing to do. Yes. It's right to get Nick killed because that's what's going to happen. You don't know now, that. Do you, uh, you still have that knife? Because if it was Matthews and Walter sees it, he's going to put two and two together. It's with the other weapons. Okay. Well, go get rid oh. of him. I'll find Walter and run interference. Oh, and uh, keep an eye out for Nick. I'm right here. What's up? Are we going to tell him? Oh, uh, there's nothing, man. I just wanted to check and see if you're okay. You coming to tuck me in? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Are they a couple? Something like that. We have to tell you something. Hey, if there's something going on, I want to know. We have to tell him. No, just go back to bed, Nick. I'm serious. No, you, you have to tell him, dude. To me. Don't treat him like a child. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. God damn it. Hey, Nick, shut the fuck up. I can't, man. I can't. Do not fucking blow it. Blow it? It's over. I have to tell him, Luke. Yes, tell what? him. Just no, tell him. You, hey, Nick, you cannot do that. Are you fucking nuts? No, he has to tell him it. what's wrong with you. I can't live with that on me. You okay, should tell Walter. You, but, f I mean, fuck, man. Do you know what he's going to do? You should tell him. You should. Yeah, yeah. Nick, I'm warning you. This is fucking suicide. If I'll you don't do it, it, and Jesus it comes Christ. out Jesus. later on, I can't handle this. it's going to be so much Look, worse. Clem, just go do that thing, all right? Why? We're going to tell him anyway. We can keep the knife. Unless he thinks I did it. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, snap, it's gone. It's gone. Well, fuck my life. Fuck me sideways. <gasps> oh, God, Walter. Hi, Walter. Um... Yeah, Walter and Matthew. Walter? Walter? 
I always like this knife. Oh dear. Gave it to Matthew when all this started. You're gonna stab me with it? I know he's dead. Who did it? Was it that, that kid? What's his name? Uh, Nick? Heard him talking earlier or something about shooting a man. Oh, God. I could see it. I could see it on his face. What's that? I wasn't sure then. But now? What's that choo choo train noise? <laughs> it was us. It was our fault. No lies. Since season one, Jesus. episode one, no lies. I am. Um, I don't feel good. I I hope he wasn't his like partner, like spouse partner, Nick because if it is gone, <laughs> I'm so sorry. I mean, he he lost his uncle recently, and it wasn't really his fault. So he's kind of uh, itchy trigger finger. Is Nick a good man? He is. He's a or really is he good just man. Like everyone else. No, no, Nick is a good guy. He is. He's a good guy, Walter. He, he's coming to tell you. He's a good guy. He was always going out alone. I told him something like this would happen, but he wouldn't listen. Oh, God. No, Matt always knew best. What's going on? You need to tell him. Tell yes. Him what? what happened on the bridge? Tell him. Tell him. Tell him. I already vouched for you. Tell me what you did. Just tell me, son. Tell me what happened. From a distance, it looked like anyone. I, I, I thought I thought he was going to shoot my friends, and I I shot Matthew. But it, it, it happened real fast. I didn't I didn't know if I hit him, but I did, and I didn't mean to. Do you know what you've done to me? Do you have any idea? I didn't mean to. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Walter. Oh. Um. Oh. oh, the fuck is happening there? Walt, what's going on? The storm's got it spinning out of control. That sound's gonna draw walkers. We gotta shut it down now. Nick, help me. Carry the guns. Guns? Oh god, I'm so sorry, Walter. Thinks a damn dinner bell. Let's go. Everyone suit up. Oh the god, hell what the hell was that? Sounded like an explosion. Damn it. Transformer must have gone. Oh shit. Check. I could use a hand. I'll go with you. I'm going to. No, it's too dangerous. God damn it, Kenny. Get this thing shut down. <laughs> I just realized I've done another God damn it, Kenny. Every time I see Kenny, it's always a God damn it, Kenny. <laughs> uh, I think I really need to cut him some slack. Does anyone know how to do this? I do. Great. I can do it. Oh, really? Okay. How do you know? We'll watch your back. Nick, scan the trees with me. Nick, you have a lot to make up for. I mean, I could feel it in my heart. Like, your partner, your spouse, your significant other being shot, and you not knowing what's happening. Like, that feeling, oh god. And then you realize you fed the person who... You fed the person who killed your spouse. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> Clem number one. She's almost reaching Mary Sue levels. <laughs> Something ain't right. Yeah. That's a walker sound. Fuck me, here they come. We don't have much ammunition. We gotta get back to the lodge. They're behind us. Well, clear a path. I, I need to make sure Sarita doesn't die. 
Uh, Clementine. Shoot. All right. Because if Sarita dies, Kenny's gonna snap. Holy shit, that's a lot. All right. One. Okay. Nice. Oops. Really? Can I not reload? Run. Just run. Thank you, Carlos. <laughs> oh, no. Damn it, the rifle. Why, why, why highlight the rifle twice? Dodge. 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 Oh. Pick it up, pick it up. Alright, shoot. Here. Holy shit, that's a kick. <laughs> the head, the head, the head. Yes, knife good. Knife good. Honestly, little girl probably should not go for the... Wait, I just realized something. Please help me. Versus whom? Oh, Nick, you owe him big. It kind of reminds me of The Walking Dead, the comic. Clem, get inside. Go. Because there's a part where Rick um, killed someone in cold blood during the prison scene, uh, prison Clementine, portion. Are you okay? I'm fine. What the? Uh, hell? we don't have automatic rifles. Oh, fuck me. <laughs> There's Carver. Anyway, yeah, I was saying. Matthew was shot in the throat, so he might still... <gasps> Fuck. Bonnie. Howdy, folks. Walt, you dumbass. Where's Rebecca? Carver. Ooh. It's nice to see you, too. Oh, Sarah! Oh, that's a huge mark. Inside. Must be quite the puncher. Well, Kenny, Walt, I did try to warn you. It's you. Keep moving. <gasps> she had that look of regret. Could it be that because we were nice to her? We could sway her decision. Fingers crossed. I, 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 I don't know. I don't know what's happening. I don't know what to do. Look at this place. Hmm. They're a small group, but they have automatic rifles, which is interesting. How did they get their hands on that? Leave this fucking place, Bonnie. Power and everything. Ooh. A lot of windows, though. Oh, down. It's fucking huge. Bill's gonna hate it. Bill. Now the rest the of them could be anywhere. Bell's Bill. Really? Man, how the fuck are we gonna cover these guys and look for them too? Oh, careful! The wooden stairs John, squeak. Cover that window. Yes, give her the evil look. Make her feel guilty as hell. How could you, Bonnie? How could you do this? I trusted you. Am I gonna knife people? <laughs> like, commando guerrilla style? Oh, she's up here too.
Oh. Oh, Listen, damn. I'm only gonna ask you once. Where's Rebecca? Sarah, look at me. It's gonna be okay. Oh! Ah! Rebecca! Oh. Rebecca! Why? Our baby deserves to be raised in a place of safety. I know you're out there. Oh. And Alvin. Oh. And the girl. This is real simple. You want this over His quick. finger. Play nice. And show your faces. Never my dad, please. He'll kill him. No, Alvin. We gotta go down there. I can't do that. You have to, Beck. Beck, the baby. You need a doctor. We have to help Carlos. Only way to help him is to do what the man says. What about Luke and Kenny? Look at those guns. We start shooting, and people are gonna die on both sides. <laughs> oh. Come get me what the hell is she gonna do? And you heard him. Carver knows she's with us. Just stop! Don't hurt my dad, please! We're going down there. He'll kill you. Fuck you. Shoot him! Somebody just shoot him! Oh. Go get him. He'll kill him, Beck. He'll do it anyway. He's gonna kill him. Rebecca, we have to give up. Come on. Grow a pair of tits. You all right? Don't touch her, you bastard. Good. You don't want to do this. Please let these people go. So that's Bill's baby. Shut up. Bill? Sorry, not Bill. Carver. That's Carver's baby. Can you reach my hands? I could? Everything under control? I'll try. Ooh. Mm. Oh, nice. Good shot. Kenny. Don't move. That's my Kenny. Watch them. Come on. Guerrilla tactics. Commando shit. Oh god, leave him alone, you asshole. Oh. <gasps> no. Walter. That's for our man. Now I didn't want to do this. But you ain't leaving me much choice. So here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna march another one of your friends out here, and I'm gonna put a bullet in the back of their head. No! Or you can give up now. Your choice. Hi, Alvin. You motherfucker. Alvin! Bill, no! Tell him to stop! Kenny, stop! You remember George, Alvin? You see, I do. I remember a guy that was your friend named George. I remember when you murdered him in cold blood. And why? Because you didn't like me? You could have lodged a complaint. You could have... Well, you could have been civil. Bill, no! We'll do whatever you want! I love you, Beck. <laughs> what am I gonna do? You want to try me? Now fucking bite your finger off. We can do this all night. Is that what you want? <sighs> Why do they always have to make someone you hate so much you just want to see them suffer? Where's Luke? He's dead. Finally cut and run, huh? Why am I not surprised? I warned you. 
I warned you not to follow him. Look where he's led you. But you're safe now. We're going home. As a family. Oh god, you crazy motherfucker. <laughs> Alright, round him up. We're heading back to camp. Wait, that's it? No, come on. There must be some way I can stop them. God damn it. No. Oh, really? Oh, so each episode seems to be getting much shorter. I don't know if we could have saved Walt, but I know one of us didn't just give up. Yeah, I know. The folks are sore over what happened. But let's remember, these are our brothers and sisters, and they all have a vital role to play in this community. They strayed from the flock, yeah. That don't mean they can't earn their way back into the fold. I don't mean we can't find it in our hearts to forgive them, knowing full well those who choose not to accept our love surely wish that they had. The storm is on the way. Oh, they always make the villains so sadistically annoying to the point where you really want to see them suffer. Anyway, my choices. Took blame for Sarah's photo. You and 51.5 blame someone else. Why Why do we need to shift the blame or take the blame or do something with the blame? Like, it's just a fucking photo, dude. You did not say, do not take a photo. Who did you sit with? 64.2 sat with Kenny. Hmm, interesting. I told Walter the truth about Matthew. 56% told Walter the truth. I really have a very strong feeling if you did not tell him the truth. I think he would find out and he might have killed Nick in that moment when he was holding the knife. Or he might have let Nick die. Like uh, when he was attacked by the walker. Nick's fate. You and 56.3 of players convinced Walter to forgive Nick. That one's a little hard, but yeah. But on, uh, honestly speaking, if we hadn't, it might have been Matthew watching Walter die. Oh. They were... They seemed like a couple with a lot of potential to develop and grow. And they kind of killed him off almost immediately, so... <laughs> left to find Kenny. Oh, we could have left to find Kenny? Well, I guess they would have caught us. You and 56.1 stayed to help Carlos. Huh. That's curious. So if we went to look for Kenny, maybe we wouldn't have been brought into the enemy camp. We would have been trailing. No, I don't think they would have thought that far. Anyway, so that's it for episode two. It seems like each episode is around an hour and a half, maybe two hours max, which is very different from the initial episodes, I feel. I felt those could go on for like two to three hours. But anyway, that might change. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the episode and the series. Take care of yourselves. And I hope to see you all for the next one, episode three. Bye.